What's going on guys? It's your boy Stickwork from MaddenSchool.com and I'm here with another Madden 20 tip. Today we're going to be on the offensive side of the ball. I'm in the New Orleans Saints playbook in the gun tight offset tight end formation uh, with the play Y out HB swing. So this is what the play looks like stock. I'm going to show you a way that's pretty simple that you can beat pretty much every single common coverage in the game. Uh, what you're going to do is just simply drag the A tight end or X tight end if you're on PS4. And that just blocked the running back. So right now we're up against a Tampa 2. Now the first thing you guys should notice is that Y receiver on his corner out. You can still throw it to him and he's very open. Uh, if you pass lead outside and or up into the outside uh, going towards the sideline. So you see right there. It's so an easy pitch and catch for a pretty big gain. Now also against the Tampa 2, you're going to have both drags. Uh, you got A going to the left. And then you're going to have the X receiver uh, going to the right side of the field. I'll show you that as well. And so those are pretty much two check downs. Um, and it's going to make the play uh, that much harder for the defense to cover since you have the two crossing drags like that. Um, so then once you see that if your opponent goes and tries to user that Y corner out, so if they go over there to user, you're just going to have that post wide open over the, the middle of the field. And then... Um, to guard the drag routes if they play underneath coverage and even leave the mid read and go try to use the Y receiver with somebody else. You're also still going to have that post route and that can turn into a huge gain as well. Um, so you can kind of really manipulate the defense with this play and as soon as they start uh, mixing their coverage uh, other things are going to be open as well um, really that post is the main thing that gets open um, so now let's go into a cover three sky so cover three sky we're still going to do the same thing again we got these drags And I'll just show both drags real quick. And then again, we're going to have this Y receiver on his corner route. And the reason kind of that I would say uh, this corner route's kind of open against pretty much everything is he's going he's obvious we're obviously in a compressed formation and a compressed formation means uh, this tight look where the receivers are basically inside the numbers they're not out wide so he's going towards the middle of the field and our drag comes across that's basically the first thing that uh, the cornerback or safety whoever's there uh, gets the attention on and then the corner route kind of goes late, uh, deeper over that cornerback. So he doesn't even really recognize uh, that that corner route's going there. So he's left wide open for a nice possession catch on the sideline. So I'll just show it again. And just so you guys can see, we are definitely in a cover three sky with purple zones. And as you see, he's just open every time. And then again, if they play underneath coverage, that Y receiver is just going to be even more open. You might even be able to possession, possession, or sorry, excuse me, you might even be able to rack catch it uh, for a bigger gain. And then so again, if they play underneath coverage, uh, you're going to be able to hit that post route. Drew Brees completely choked that pass, so we'll show that again 
Um, but throwing the post route against the cover three, you got to be careful. Most of the time you want to either possession catch or just get down. Not sure what Breeze is doing at that point. I did that twice in a row now. And I'll just move my user just so you guys can see that that linebacker is not going to play it as well. So then again, if they play underneath. And the post route's going to be there. <clears throat> kind of in between the zones. Uh, so now I'll quickly take you through a cover four. And we'll just run a cover four drop. So again, similar reads. As you see that wide receiver on his corner out, you can still hit it, even against the cover forward drop. The drag routes, of course, are going to be here. <clears throat> As we see, Drew Brees just choking some of the easiest throws right now. But nonetheless, open receivers uh, pretty much everywhere on the field. I'll just show the A tight end real quick. Go into that left side. Then against the cover four, you could still potentially have the post as well. Uh, you just have to be wary of the linebackers. And so as you see, we'll get a little bit of traffic, so you need to just possession catch it. Um, but against the cover four, I wouldn't really recommend uh, getting too comfortable throwing that post all the time. And then if they play underneath coverage as well, again, that wide receiver is just going to be a little bit even more open, a little bit less traffic to worry about. Uh, but so, yeah, pretty much just a good, simple base play uh, that's got a lot of good crossing routes and can attack multiple levels of the field against the uh, zone coverage. But so, as always, guys, it's stickwork with MaddenSchool.com. Hope you enjoyed this tip.